But yeah, what we got going on in the news today? Oh, big news, big news. Mr. Derek Chauvin, the former Minneapolis police officer who was convicted in the 2020 murder charge, murder, excuse me, of George Floyd, was stabbed in federal prison Friday in Arizona. And if y'all don't know who that is... <laughs> Round of applause. <laughs> yeah, man. That's, that's the man that killed... Round of applause. Was, George, was it George, George Floyd? Floyd? George yeah, Floyd. George Floyd. Okay, so Derek Chauvin is the officer who actually had his knee on Floyd's neck. Now, they've been coming back trying to get him in the pill, saying that, you know, his knee wasn't the cause of death. You know, they're trying to say Floyd overdosed. He was already flatlined before his knee went on his neck, which if you looked at the footage, you know that's nonsense. But how y'all feel about this? I'm an eye for an eye type of nigga, man. So... I feel like we'll go around, they, what they say, you reap what you sow. We'll go around, gonna come right back, man. And uh, I don't wish death on nobody, but it is what it is when shit, when shit come your way. Especially if you're out here doing dirt. Especially the innocent people on top of that. You know what I mean? You can play the game with the people you play the game with, but shout out to the people in the pen, man. Y'all, 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 <laughs> y'all did y'all stuff. Justice. Yeah, <laughs> y'all do diligence. That's a fact. I think that's a fact. If you, if you out there doing shit like that and you moving like a predator, you know, you got up in there and now you're to pray. So it's like, that's what it really comes down to. You opened yourself up, you know, put that out in the universe, uh, took that young man's life. And so, I mean, like you said, I'm an eye for an eye type of nigga. So I think it's only right, you know, and hey man, if you if you survive, you better keep your head on a swivel. Right. I mean, for me, this should be prime example of what should happen anytime any excess police brutality goes on. Your job is to enforce the law, and I know you got to protect your life when it comes down to it, but tape after tape, video after video, we see these, these cops over-exercising their rights and killing unarmed people. This is what should happen. Eye for an eye, like he said. I'm not even eye for eye. I want two eyes for one. You know what I'm saying? That'll, that'll calm all that down. This is why they trying to take away people's Second Amendment rights, because if more cops start getting done how they doing people, they'll think twice before they do people like that. How you put your knee on somebody's neck for 10 minutes and got the nerve to say, oh, this wasn't what killed him. The man sitting there saying, I can't breathe for 10 minutes. You but talking look, about he overdosed, he od But look how, look how quick you said, like you said, they, they trying to hear up and get him out. They can't survive the reality that many of us as black men go through every day. You know what I mean? Come, come in them stomping grounds and they, they ready to release niggas. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? Fast. So it's like, that's, that's crazy. No, that, but, that's a fact. That, that's a super fact. It's like, they quick to throw us in there for 100 years. Like you said, hey, how, how long you been in there? Two years, three years? They already, man, we got to hurry up and get him out. We finna yeah. make up any. We going against video evidence to get him out. <laughs> so shout out whoever, you know what I'm saying, put that work in because this was the demonstration that needed to happen. They needed to know it's consequences behind doing what you're doing. Even though you a cop, you ain't above the law even though we like to act like they is or they like to act like they are, but you ain't above the law. You ain't above prosecution. You know what I'm saying? Persecution, whatever word you want to use. This need to happen more often. You yeah, but me? take away their team, take away they, they, all their buddies yeah. and take away their guns and, and then, you, then you see what they really stand on. Yeah, that... that uh, He probably was getting his ass beat before he got <laughs> poked up, really. You know what I mean? He had to be He yeah. had to be in PC too. So, so that was somebody in PC probably banged him out. <laughs> it's crazy. <laughs> Cause they already all bad over there. So for you to get banged up in PC, you know it's all bad. 